Yeah. So funky. So funky. Real spit. Niggas hit the pavement when I come through slow in a six boat yeah. hanging out yeah. the window. Niggas hit the pavement when I fall through the club, yeah. chucking up the dub on your scrubs. Niggas hit the pavement, DF on the beat. Yeah. You don't yeah. work, you don't eat. Niggas hit the pavement, real true statement. Grind to they pavement, real niggas hit the pavement. One thing about this funk, I think it was necessary. And anytime it's necessary, it's gonna happen on its own. No one man can take credit for us breaking down the wall or the barrier of not working together. We always knew that we were good at what we did, and we knew we'd be great if we did something together. So what we did was we just, you know, stood up as men and made it happen. And the the on the scrubs, niggas hit the pavement, DF on the beat, if you don't work, then you don't eat. Came to watch him DJ and sing and mix and do all of that at the same time and had to get on the mic because I was like, this motherfucker go. For the G's, popping my P's, dotting my eyes while crossing my T's. Me and Dame speaking game, doing shows overseas. 40 years old, had my fucking enemies. Check, cheddar, fold, redder, let them all better. If you knew better, then you probably do better. Act like you know. No, not better, no better. Cause niggas hit the pain. Just a matter of being able to respect each other's craft and say that. I want to work with you. We just did that. He opened up his, his house and opened the door for me to come over here and do my thing. And when I came in here, it was like, it was too big for it to be a song. It had to be a, a movie. And that's what we're on. We've been on seven days of fun. Oh, tis the season. It is what it is. Seven days of fun. Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. I always call it like the dirty uncle in the attic that uh, a lot of the family doesn't want really, to you know, see, but they know who's up there. That's like what we are in music. Mm-hmm. You know, that dirty uncle that you go up and check him out every now and then, and then you're amazed by the knowledge and wisdom he can probably give you. You know what I'm saying? You know, so that's what funk is to me. It's like just a continuation. Um, of, of what we know and live, you know what I mean? And just not stopping. Snoop was cool enough to like, you know, continue his funk. You know, instead of it being the P funk, we made it the G funk. But you can't got you can't have the G without the P, so it was all connected. Without the you know, without the P funk there would never be a G funk. Oh my Influences for me, Lucy Collins. Of course, my favorite is Slave. I'm definitely Charlie Wilson and the Gap Band. It's alive and well. It's been like not about us. It's about the funk, y'all. It's about the funk. Shout out to one real funky motherfucker that I had a chance to be in the studio with. Did a record with Rick James. I don't think it's bad that you're no good. All the buffoonery. And to think I bought you, you were Now look what you do. Thing Rick told me is we always keep the folk alive. So that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna continue to keep the folk alive. Wasn't true. Yeah. I'm glad I flew away from you. It's what you showed me. Wasn't true. This is a record about us giving the people what they want. They requested this record right here. Yeah, you was forced to do it. <laughs> <laughs> Salute to that. We was forced to do this record. Yeah. I mean, anything else would be uncivilized. Uh, us is probably keep it moving. Thank you, G O D. From a W I N G C. Thank you, G O D. From a W I N G C. Like when we put it out, it's gonna speak for itself. And you can let people know the release date we're working on, it's coming soon, etc., etc. But if the shit ain't right, who gives a fuck? There you go. As long as we like it. You hear me? Get away! I'm down to get all the characters with that right put on one of them suits for the whole night.